Chris, this health leaders are calling this a game changer. We're talking about the new antibody tests. The health system announced yesterday they're here and they're being used in Beaumont. But what makes these different than COVID-19 rapid tests? 12 News investigator Lauren Hensley spoke with hospital reps today to get those answers. Yeah, Chris, this hospital leaders say that these tests are going to provide another sense of surveillance as well as a sense of confidence. Now they explained the tests are currently running on some hospital workers and certain patients. And they explained today how the antibody test is different than the COVID-19 rapid test. There are two main approaches for testing for COVID-19 and they search for different things. The first one is the PCR test. It's considered the gold standard, and you're probably familiar with that one. This test detects the virus by identifying viral RNA. The sample is collected through a nasal swab and sent to a lab. This test is primarily for people showing symptoms. The new antibody test doesn't detect the virus. Instead, it looks for antibodies that your immune system makes when fighting off COVID-19. Doctors test this with a blood sample and doctors believe this testing will eventually allow more people to be tested. Again, to provide that extra level of, of surveillance and confidence in our communities that were uh, not only is Chris's health facilities a safe place to, to visit for your care, uh, but it will help us get back to normal activities from a society perspective as well as an economic perspective. Right now at Christus, the antibody tests are being used on medical care providers to help identify asymptomatic carriers. The results of the test could prevent someone from unknowingly passing on the virus. The negative, the test made by Heligen Scientific has not been FDA approved. We had this testing in-house for several weeks uh, validating the, uh, the tests and we feel really good about the accuracy of the testing. Helogen Scientific has filed for an emergency use authorization. Doctors at Christus say when an antibody test result comes back positive, a PCR test will be given to that patient to ensure the results are accurate. Doctors say if the FDA approves the test, the long-term plan would be roll out more testing sites. Now, you just can't show up at the hospital to get one of these tests or even call to get one. Again, right now they're being reserved for those healthcare providers on the front lines, as well as certain patients like those who come in for emergency surgery. Lauren Hensley, 12 News Investigates.